stand-up comedy. Woo! Yeah, me too. Like, I mean, well, <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> there are better things. I just don't envy you, is what I'm saying. Sitting there for an hour, listening to my opinions. <laughs> no, thank you. I think I just don't like stand-up that much, because there is a tendency, there is a tendency for comedians during an hour show to get very vulnerable. <laughs> Reveal a very deep trauma about themselves. A secret. And I know I should admire it, but when I'm in the crowd watching them open up, I'm just like, oh, you're a fucking moron. <laughs> we can all see you. <laughs> I know it's not good because I'm in the audience and I don't know what to do with my hands. I'm like, I don't know what to touch. I just think I'm self-aware enough to know there are better things to watch than me. Like, there is nothing I can do tonight that would be as funny as, like, three estate agents. <laughs> Letting loose a Mallorca. <laughs> Walking around a pool and then falling in and shitting themselves. <laughs> that is my sort of comedy. Like, oh, like yes, please. I would just define my comedy maybe more like YouTube trash. <laughs> For scum. <laughs> Do we have any scum in? <laughs> Great self-awareness, babe. Seriously, you should have cheered. I, <laughs> I just love YouTube. I'm obsessed with YouTube fails. Does anyone watch it? Yeah, obviously. <laughs> love you. Mainly because I've just found the wedding playlist. Now, look, I, I want you all to like me a lot. I do. I just need us all to agree that there is nothing better in the entire world than a bride's day being completely ruined. <laughs> and the light falling out of her eyes. <laughs> Come on, it's amazing! Okay, I found this one video. It is life-changing. Um, it's a bride and her big day. I'm assuming her name's like Lauren or something. She's basic <laughs> as fuck. <laughs> you look so awkward, your name's not Lauren, is it? Oh, thank God, what's your name? Cara. Cara? Okay, well, same thing. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? You were like Lauren, gross. Cara, a.k.a. creative parents. Not just that sounds so bitchy. <laughs> Oh my God, I'm obviously saying basic with love. I'm also basic. Look at my hoops. <laughs> it's just... Personally, I define myself as basic plus because I'm self-aware with it. Does that make sense? Like I've got scented candles. Of course I do. I'm not a freak. It's just... I don't switch them out seasonally. Like I'm not throwing away pumpkin spice on November 1st. Because <laughs> I believe in me. I'm a bit of fun. <laughs> Cara. <laughs> I knew this bride was basic for one main reason. Because she was walking down the aisle to Beauty and the Beast. Which is right, like, ugh, like we get it, right? You're the beauty, they're the beast, he's gonna rescue you. Ah, work on yourself! As women in this country, we still don't have equal pay and sometimes it does feel like some women aren't trying hard enough. <laughs> Embarrassing at this point. Walking down the aisle to Taylor's old as time. And as she was going, her dad stepped on her train and outflopped a tit. And what was so lush just for the women, you could see in her eyes it wasn't the good one. <laughs> Like, we know when the good one flops out, like, obviously we pretend to be embarrassed. We're not whores. You're like, oh, oh my God, it's so embarrassing. I'm so sorry, you're a fucking pervert. Like, but secretly, it's like, yes. <laughs> They're both the same. Like, which is your favorite tip you've got? Yeah, me too. Is that when you lick your nipple and blow on it? It wrinkles up slower. Yeah, no, me neither. Ah! What the fuck? Every woman should have a favorite tip. If you don't have 
everyone figure it out. <laughs> Stuff's important. I know which one my favourite tit is because I get drunk and I take it out. <laughs> For attention. <laughs> Should make it clear that makes it sound like I have a problem. I only get my tit out when I'm drunk, so it's like super classy. <laughs> just it happens a lot because I drink a lot I love drinking you guys are drinking this makes me feel like very at home right now because I think I drink so much because it's one of the few things I'm genuinely good at I know I'm good at it because I can currently drink three bottles of rosé wine in one sitting Thank you. <laughs> I feel like most of us are impressed by that. Apart from this man just drinking a beer, looking at me like, three bottles, she can't do it. She's too thin. Correct! <laughs> yeah, I'm a lucky woman and sometimes I forget to eat. Am I right, Cara? Salad. <laughs> <laughs>